What's up guys, it's your boy Gang. Welcome back to another mod review video. In this video, we'll be taking a look at the TLX Camp It Pack. Um, this is by, I think it is... Uh, as 82 Squared Studio, I believe is, is who it is. Um, these are the guys who brought you the TLX. Um, the TLX is a truck you see here. So this is, uh, this is more of a... I want to say role-playing attachment versus a functional attachment um basically in order to get this you're gonna need the tlx you're gonna need a tlx um pick up the, the truck pack as you see right there and you have two type of the camp it's you have the camp it and you have the camp it trailer so you can have both of those attached to it, each other and um so on and so forth so let's go ahead and take a look at where it's located it's located under tools under miscellaneous here you have the camp it and then here you have the camp it trailer now each one of these are 10 slots each the first time you purchase it download size is going to be 20.88 megabytes um again functionality is based off of um role playing and you will see it when you go into the the, the mod itself um to test it out so if you're going to the camp it the normal one you only have two options well three options two color and then additional now what additional does is it changes a few things on it so first of all you have the skylight which as you can see just has that thing on the top you have the sleeper which the top opens up turns into a sleeper um you have the um enable on in and then enable on in too so enable on in is basically just the skylight with an on in and then enable on in too is the sleeper plus the on in and that as well as this has basically the same options with the exception of adding the rim color um wheel brand so you can go stock sport off-road off-road winter all terrain back to stock um wheel setup you have duals nokian street and then that's basically it. so you don't pay for the duals you don't pay for the the street you don't pay for the nokian those are no additional costs um draws these are on the side i believe you're right there you can see them so you have diamond plated you have main color you have design color black metal back to diamond plated here you have the same options as you had previously so you have skylight sleeper which adds those things there enable on in and then enable on in two and then that's basically it so those are the options now <clears throat> what's interesting about these is you pull up to here you hit attach right let's go ahead and back up over here a bit here's something that's unique um, it acts as a vehicle so if you press either the left or the right um, button on the directional pad you can actually access this vehicle and if you look there you see yourself sitting down in it if you push if you where is it um, if you push the right joystick in of course again this is on xbox guys right joystick in you're in i think that is first person and this is basically what inside of the vehicle looks like and then if you do lb and a it opens the door right there lb and the left directional what that does is it, it opens the awning and the sleeper on top and that's basically it and that's the same functionality as this one enter the vehicle you do LB and A opens the fold or unfold role play oriented attachment, right? Push the R stick in, you're back in first person. You do LB and the left directional button, it opens up that hatch. That's the difference. So this one right here is the, that's the skylight. That's the sleeper with the on it. And that's basically all it is. There are no additional features to this. Um, I'm not even sure you can actually get in here without pressing X to enter the vehicle. Uh, can I even get up on top of this ladder? No. So this is like a good role playing thing. You, you want to hypothetically in the game, say you're taking a break from farming this weekend, you're going um, camping, stuff like that. That's what you'll do. And that's basically it for this mod, guys. If you guys did have, if you guys did have, no. If you guys did like this video please go ahead and hit the like button if you want to stay up to date with us going on please go ahead and subscribe if you want to get notified every time i post an update please go ahead and hit the bell beside the subscribe button 
And if you have any tips, comments, suggestions, please go ahead and leave them below. And I'll get back to each and every one of you guys. Thank you guys again for watching.